Hello guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I wanted to come and do a little solo mom nighttime routine because Jeff is out of town. You guys will know soon what that's about, but it's dinner time and I'm over mom's house because we just got done with the daycare. Little plate, he is not gonna eat all this because it's a lot, but it's gonna cool really quickly. And then Copeland is over here trying to get a whole tent through his Gigi's door. He's got chocolate on his face. Colvin, can you say hello? Hello. Say hi. Hi. Okay. Here. All right. It's almost time for dinner. What do you think? Yummy. As you can see, we still have a birthday banner up. That is from the day before yesterday. Someone celebrated a birthday. But it's time to eat. I have mine right here. And I am super excited. How's the food? It's good. All right. He said it himself. It's good. Hi. All right, guys. Time to go home. Like serious too. Copeland, I'm gonna get you. That's why when I say hey, you ain't gonna be acting like that when I get there. Uh oh. He just popped, he just popped me too. Oh, oh, he he wanna play. Copeland. He trying to play. He's trying to say hi. Daddy, he's trying to say hi. Daddy, say sorry, Daddy. Daddy. Say sorry, Daddy. Say sorry, Daddy. Daddy. <laughs> Colin, are you ready to come out? Let's get you out, buggy. Let's take you out. And we need to get your jacket off, okay? Okay. All right, guys, so finally in the house. Thank God to my sweet next door neighbor. He helped me in with the boys and some of the grocery bags, so that was awesome. But I have tons of stuff here that I got from the grocery store. I'm looking at it and I'm like, Jeff isn't even here. And I swear I have even more stuff than I do when he's here. But it may look like that. However, I am making Cohen a lot of baby food. I have pretty much slacked when it comes to the baby food for Cohen. Like with Copeland, I was on it. Like as soon as he turned like four to five months, I was cooking and doing everything. But this daycare has been keeping us so busy. So. I went out, got a whole bunch of fresh produce. Um, I got him some organic chicken, some quinoa, um, ton of vegetables, fruits, and I am going to be filming a homemade baby food thing, I think tomorrow, so we'll see how that goes. But it's time to put it all away. All done, we have tons of stuff in there, and I think we should be good for the weekend. Right, Copeland? All right guys, so what usually happens now is I am straightening up everything. Usually it's me and Jeff, but dang Copeland. <laughs> but I'm straightening up everything, getting it clean for the weekend. And then, oh my Lord, oh my Lord. And then I am going to start getting them baths and all of that, okay? Okay. Do y'all hear my child? He's over there acting like he's dying. And he's doing this because he is not nap today. And it's because of his teeth, so I'm trying to love on him as much as I can. But he brought this upon himself. I'm talking about you. Hi. All right, guys, we're gonna use the stuff that I put into his Cohen. Cohen. I think you needed this. Oh, the bubbles. <laughs> He's very, very grunty right now because he has a little cold. See, but I'm gonna feel better. I'm happy I went ahead and put him in the tub because he's already much more calm 
this kid has been exhausting today. He is such a good baby, but lately because of his teething, he has just not wanted to nap. So if he doesn't nap all day, you can imagine by this time of night, he is done. So this bath hopefully should help. Um, it has lavender in it, Coco. So it's probably very soothing, so yeah. I've been using Selsun Blue for Cohen's um, hair for the cradle cap and it is amazing. He pretty much has nothing left for cradle cap. So I also did this for Copeland and it worked wonderfully. Hey, wet baby alert, wet baby alert. Chew those hands, yes. You're so grabby. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> all right, he is all clean. Time for a bottle. You ready? Let's go get a bottle. Corn is finishing his bottle. As you can see, he's enjoying it. His arm is up for some odd reason. That's, yeah, that's really weird. I'm super excited because I found this at Target and it's a little alphabet chart. And in the pockets, you put the little cards of the pictures that go with the letters. So I think Copeland's gonna enjoy this and we're gonna do this this weekend. Are you ready to get in the bathtub? No. How come? You don't know? <laughs> All right, Copeland is gonna get a chance to finally use his crayons and the bath drops. All right, Copeland, here, you can put it in there. Throw it in the in the tub. Good job. Now look what color. Look. Look, what color is that? Blue. All right, doing some cool coloring. All right, I'm gonna get Mr. Cohen's bassinet ready. What on earth? Why is there crayons and markers in here? Oh, only Copeland, only Copeland, only Copeland. Okay. Night, night, Colin. I am in here tidying up their room and trying to fold these last uh, few clothes that we washed this week. I'm really tired. And I really miss my husband. He is such a huge help when it comes to stuff around the house and with the boys. Like, I am very, very lucky. So right now, because he's gone, I really miss him. Room is decent. Got the clothes folded. Their room is good. Uh, living room is pretty clean. Cohen, my little baby. He's asleep. And then kitchen is pretty much tidy, so I'm happy. So I think I'm just gonna clean, like wipe down the computer desk off, and then I'm gonna wash Copeland's hair, detangle, and then we're gonna read some bedtime stories, and we're good. This is what happens when we detangle. <laughs> I told you guys I was going to give you guys a realistic look on our nighttime routine and a real look at motherhood. It's not butterflies and rainbows. It's screaming kids. Cohen is in there now screaming because he heard his brother scream. So, yes, here we go. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah? Are we almost done? Yeah. Oh, not all done. Almost done. Okay. All right. Copeland is good, but his brother is not. I'm going to be using this leave-in conditioner by TGIN. And then I'm just going to add a little bit of this oil on top. All right. Come on, Copeland. Time for milk. Let's go get some milk. Oh, but wait, first let's brush teeth. Copeland, let's brush your teeth first. Okay. Copeland has his milk and he has requested to watch Super Y, so why not? All right, it is time to read some stories. We are gonna read 
this one, which is the All Better book. Copeland got this one for his birthday. And then this one was in Cohen's Easter basket. Copeland just happens to love it because of all the animals. So, Hello, baby. Who are you? I am. Are you a monkey with clever toes? Perhaps you're a porcupine twitching its nose. Uh, eagle. Eagle. Are you an eagle exploring the skies? <gasps> Perhaps you're a gecko with rolling eyes. No, this is All right, Kopi, come on. Are you so tired? All right, let's say our prayers really quick. Fold your hands. Jesus, Jesus, thank you, you for it, it. we love you. Abby, um, Amen. Good night, Buggy. Give me a kiss. Give mommy a kiss. Mwah. All right, good night. Your brother's going to be in here with you for a little bit, okay? See how that goes. And on that note... I will see you guys in the next one. If you guys enjoyed this, big thumbs up. This is our evening routine with a toddler and a baby. I'm exhausted. I will see you all later. Bye.